Hey y'all, welcome back, welcome back to another reaction video. I don't know where that came from, but it's here, so the video's done. Go ahead, intro. I support a black owned business. I run my city from the west side, big to best, I do a day to shite. Wayne, Louisiana, Dr. Dre, the Los Angeles, this is it, bitch, Michael Misfit. Hot huh? day, a legend and moonwalk, sliding across the stage in 87, this that Tupac out the window, both hands throwing up that middle finger, fuck them other niggas, ratchet bitches in my demons, yeah, I'm queen. Hey y'all, welcome back to another reaction video. I am your host with the most Natalie Love, here to provide you comedic commentary for these here reaction videos that I'm here to facilitate, okay? With that being said, you did hear correctly, reaction videos, which means you are here right now for me to react, okay? I'm not a quiet person, I'm a chatty Cathy during the videos, probably after the videos and definitely before the videos. Why? Because I have some shit to say to you. So I'm gonna go ahead on and say it. But if you don't like frequent pauses, chatty Cathy's, or a person that curses, I am not your cup of tea, but there is definitely a person that will like a sip, okay? So if any of that moves you to negative words, go ahead and exit stage left. I would rather have you just go ahead and leave now than to type me a paragraph that nobody ever sees, okay? Now that we got that part out of the way, second half of the housekeeping rules, okay? Oh, I said them both. <laughs> bow, 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 bow. Killing you hoes. Anyway, make sure you like. Why? Because it helps us grow. Make sure you comment. Why? Just to let the Love family know that you done subscribed. So we can say something to you. Thank you for coming. Huh? Thank you for watching. Now, if you are A1 from day one, always here to stay one, you already know. Welcome. You already know I'm glad you here. Huh? I'm glad you here. I'm glad you're choosing to be here with me all the time anyway. I know it's at least 5,000 of y'all strong that's going to watch the video. Strong. Cock. Diesel. You know what I'm saying? If you don't catch it when it come out, you on the replay on Saturday. I appreciate you. I need you to know that I can see that shit. I also can see that it's a lot of about, what, 75% of y'all that watch that ain't subscribed. Why? I was giving you time to type up your goddamn answer. Why? Okay? It ain't no reason you done came and watched me that much and you ain't subscribed. Hell, if you watch me once, subscribe anyway. You never know what you may see or what you may need. The Lord must moves in mysterious ways. Amen. Amen. He also moved over here. What the fuck is up, love family? As y'all already know, this is your girl, Natalie Love. And yes, I've been gone for a minute, but bitch, I'm back with the jump off. Not only that, bitch, I'm back with motherfucking merch, okay? Y'all love Teeny so much, I got her on the shirt. Y'all love being from the new revival tree of life, institutional double rock on the side of the road, missionary Baptist church of Mount Calvary. Bitch, I got a shirt for that. Do the Lord allow cussing. Wow. Okay, fuck it. But I got shirts. Y'all make sure to get off your ass or stay on your ass. Just stay on your phone and go to that website and look up some shit about me and get a shirt. All right. So if you want to be of God, if you want to be of the new revival tree of life, institutional dump rock on the side of the road, missionary Baptist church of Mount Calvary. And you want to let other people know, including me, because you can send me a motherfucking picture with your shirt on. Stop by the Natalie love dot com and purchase your merch okay now i told y'all why i had this shirt on in previous videos and if you ain't seen it yet you sleep wake up wake up okay stop by that the natalie love.com and stop playing all right y'all already know how this thing go we are watching five freaky videos recorded by ring cameras okay i don't know what the fuck you gonna see why because y'all send these videos to me and i react to them and thank you so much okay let me go ahead and do what we normally do let's make sure we're recording and we are about let's get into this video home security technology has come a yes, long way has. doorbell cameras such as ring have become extremely popular in recent Got to order years me one. acting as an effective deterrent from potential robbers or any other kind of unwelcomed guests their ability to record video whenever someone comes within range to the front of a house or any other section of the house that they're installed in creates an added level of security to a person's uh -huh, home. Put it down, bitch. With the Get millions out of, here. of ring doorbell With cameras that installed throughout America, your head. Beanie has come wearing, a lot bitch. of creepy footage, including the following. This first piece of footage was captured by the ring camera in the LeMay household. LeMay. It happened on a cold December night in 2019. A stranger hacked into the LeMay family's ring security system and had watched them around their home. And for nearly 10 minutes, he interacted with 8-year-old <laughs> Alyssa. Not only was he able to watch her, but he was able to communicate noises to her 
as he had access to a second system placed in the girl's babysitter's room downstairs. See, Melissa then heard music. You can't even have cameras in, bedroom, in your house. Shared with her what happened? What just happened? Oh, the video still going. It's some in the video. Uh, the volume cut off. Hold on, is it me? Oh, the volume back on. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm like, I can still see shit flying around the room, so that means we still moving. You could have told us you wasn't going to say nothing, Earl. Yeah, that's terrifying. Damn, how many kids y'all got in that one room? Is that a crib over there and three beds? Actually realized someone was watching her in the bedroom because the blue light from the room camera was is this? Then in a strange man's the voice, she bears? heard this. Hello there. Oh my God. That's so violent. You talking to my child. The eight-year-old gasped and tried to figure out where the voice was coming from. She would pick up her toys to see if they were what was making Aww, the noises. Oh, because Toy Story exists. In the room, and moments later, the man started screaming a racial slur at her. Over oh, Lord. Sounds like he's one of her. What kind of racial slur did he start yelling? That's crazy. Like, it's people literally sit up in dark rooms all day and think of shit like over this and to over. do. Until Alyssa responded by screaming this. What? I can't hear you. I can't hear you. The man proceeded to tell her to go call her mom the racial slur and demand that she repeat it back to him. Moments later, the voice would reply to Alyssa asking who are you by saying he's her best friend. He's Santa Claus. Who is that? I'm your best friend. I'm Santa Claus. You're a pervert. I'm, I'm Santa Claus. Don't you want to be my best That's friend? That's who you want to play with in the house, an eight-year-old little girl? I'm Santa Claus. After all of this, the man tries to tell the girl she can do whatever she wants, including break things in her room. I'm your best friend. You can do whatever you want I done heard her right call now. her mama two, three times. Where is your mama? You can mess up your room. You can break your TV. You can do whatever you want. The LeMay family, who resides in Memphis, Tennessee, hope to use the device to keep an eye on their daughters while they play. Make sure you tell the scary everything thing else about what they say. It took only a few days for the camera to be hacked. Perhaps the scariest thing is that no one knows how long he had access to the device. This could have gone on even longer if the hacker decided not to produce any sounds through the device. That's crazy. Put yourself in the little girl's Fuck shoes. The little girl. Imagine hearing a creepy song playing in your bedroom, not knowing yeah, where it's coming from only to realize that it's coming from a camera system that you set up in there and that someone could be watching you. Now imagine waking up to that in the middle of the night. Yeah, nah. In another That's similar scenario, here's the footage from a ring camera that was also then taken not over by that, a hacker who attempted How many of y'all pay bills out loud? You see what I mean? Like, yeah, you want cameras in the house, but sometimes it's just like not even... I, I want something that don't connect to the internet. Connect that shit to the TV. And that's all it connect to. I don't want nothing that can talk back to me. Like, I want a ring, uh, a ring for the doorbell. That's outside. Hack all into that. That's fine. You can't see nothing no way. But inside of my home, I don't want nothing that I can control by voice. Uh, Alexa, cut the lights. That No. Nuh-uh. It's only room for one queen in here. No, ma'am. That kind of stuff terrifies me. A, because like I said, how many of y'all pay bills out loud? You done read your credit card numbers. You done had to confirm your address. You done confirmed your phone number. Some places you got to call require your social security number. You done gave your information. You don't know what these people done heard. And you don't know if they can just see the daughter's room. They done violated your child entirely just because any grown man... Or man child that's willing to play with an eight year old like that. It's not fucking funny. And then when you hear the little girl calling her mama, her mama not responding for whatever reason. You don't know what somebody could be thinking. That's that's terrifying. A young girl while she was watching television. Yeah, I don't want that shit in my house. I'm cool. What you watching?
hey, what show is that? That sounds like an adult grown man. The father man. and homeowner, Adam Kersalik, had set up the ring camera in his kitchen. In the footage, a voice can be heard speaking to his daughter after he mm -hmm. momentarily Give me a camera that do room. not talk. I've seen that show before. What season, Jan? That's a grown man. Hello? When Adam re-enters the room and opens the fridge, the voice says, what are you eating? Hello? What are you eating? Because I know ain't nobody in here. I know ain't nobody in here. You hungry? And to realize it is coming from your camera. He looks around at first, rightfully confused as to where the voice could be coming from. Though he eventually catches on and approaches mm -hmm. the camera as he asks, who is this? Adam disabled the camera shortly after the video ends, and he expressed his disappointment in Amazon's lack of security on their products. That's crazy. He said he was never advised to set up two-factor verification when he installed the camera six months ago. But you prior. have somebody literally sitting because up trying to guess? Because of the lack guess? of security on the Ring devices, he has since taken down all his interior yeah. cameras. This and the Lemoy family's horror stories aren't the only ones of their kind, though. As since 2019, over 10 other families in different states had reported that hackers have spoken to them through the devices. That's terrifying. That's terrifying. That is terrifying. Or Kim. I don't, I don't want nothing in my house that can talk back to me. Mm-mm. Hey, Google is enough. And she better not respond too quick. Because if that phone lock and I say, hey, Google. On November 12th, 2019, the disturbing footage of a woman screaming for help was captured from a Ring doorbell's camera in a small neighborhood of Los Angeles around 11 p.m. The screaming is followed by a white vehicle speeding down the street with the trunk open, from which the screaming is coming from. Yeah, she's definitely being trafficked. And that's fucked up. Y'all hear her. She screamed that long down the damn street. Police were not aware of the doorbell footage until the following morning, but on the night of November 12th, they responded to a report of a possible kidnapping. Police couldn't find any evidence of a kidnapping at first. However, after the footage came to light, the LAPD reopened their investigation. A witness claimed she also heard a man say, I'm sorry, which you can hear in the video at one point. The sad thing is, this was two years ago, and nothing ever surfaced with this. Mm. If this was an actual kidnapping, the, trunk is the kidnapping wide was open. never found. This was the footage captured around 3 a.m. on a man's ring camera. Not much more information than that was shared. However, multiple conclusions can be drawn from what's seen. It starts with a masked woman seemingly trying to enter the man's house, until she notices the doorbell camera, at which point she stares into the camera for almost 40 seconds. Halfway into her disturbing gaze into the camera, she puts on a pair of goggle-type glasses and pulls the mask covering her mouth and nose up higher onto her face, clearly trying to mask her identity as much as possible. Because you think I'm gonna open the door? Before she walks away, she makes several hand gestures into the camera, then turns and appears to grab something from behind one of the walls of the house. Girl, get your ass the fuck from in front of my door. Cause who you think finna open the door for you looking like that? As she slowly walks away from the house, you might assume she's leaving for good. However, you can see she continues to pace back and forth in front of the house until the video hits the two minute mark, at which point the doorbell camera is set to stop recording. After the video ends, however, according to neighbors, the woman was seen standing outside the house for at least another 20 to 30 minutes before finally disappearing. It's not known who this woman was, whether it be a crazy stalker ex-girlfriend or someone completely random, this begs the question, what could she have wanted with the owner of the house? 
Yeah, no, given they didn't have to figure out what she needed, because ain't no toe. way. It's obvious she came to that house with intentions of masking her identity. Why is a question that may never be answered. And with this last one, we see a scene that seems like oh, it was she taken looked, straight she from one of the hundreds of anyway. stories I've read on the channel. Once again, at some off hour in the night, a woman approached the front door of a Reddit user's dad's friend's <laughs> house somewhere on the east coast of the United she States. She got her fear false The woman flip. seems to have a slight smile on her face at first, as she looks around the front door of the house all confused like. She stands there for two full Is minutes she at a knife? least, acting nervous and confused, Does she have... looking behind her several times a in a paranoid manner. But what is most concerning about this unexpected visit was the large kitchen. Oh, okay, knife I'm in not her tripping. Hand. And, and it's in her it's inside in of finish. her sleeve. Yeah, now y'all better come get uh uh what's his name? Jason Voorhees mama. The fuck off my porch. While the generally accepted theory on this was that the woman has some form of dementia, and while this she knew to go grab a knife, what kind of dementia she got? be hundred percent confirmed simply based on the video. While it is unfortunate if she does in fact have dementia or any other sort of illness that caused her to do this, it would still be hard to imagine just how scary this would be for the owner of the yeah, house. Yeah, you bobbing back and forth. She's holding the knife from his doorbell. Camera. She she know how to hold it. Was she crazy in her past life? Surveillance cameras in general have come a long way in providing security to people's properties. While ring doorbell cameras continue to prove to be useful in adding a layer of defense or serving as a mental deterrent to uninvited guests, you clearly have to be cautious about setting up these cameras on the inside of your yeah, house no. because of the potential for hackers to gain access to them, as seen in the first two examples in this video. Mm -mm. But who just, who just sits up and thinks of ways to hack into people's camera systems like that's that's what you're doing that's what you had on your mind to do today there's nothing else in the world to be done it's, it's something wrong with people it's something wrong with people i can't stand humans i really cannot but y'all already know how this thing go we're going right into the next one huh i'm gonna keep it moving Okay, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, bye.